Hey, good morning, Summit. This is Edward, and you know this guy. This is Jake. He's wearing his blue shirt. This is his normal um, outfit that he normally wears. Jake, do you see my shirt? Camera makes me look fat. Hey, you see my shirt? It's my favorite shirt. Yep. It's my favorite <clears throat> one. Hey, share this on all your platforms, all that's going on in different areas. We're gonna be sharing some things about October that's coming up. Really exciting things that, um, in fact, every, almost every Sunday in October, there's something happening. And uh, well, I, well, you said two weeks ago that it always happens on Sunday, like block parties, expectations, absolutely balloons. Absolutely. Hey, there's going to be a block party again this Sunday, man. Uh, we're we're going to continue that. I, I there's a cold front coming in today. That's hey, all I care about, man. That's all I care uh, about. I tell you what's not been cold though. What? You're preaching, man. It's been on fire. Well, hey, Woo! Man. It, uh, hey and that's you, maybe why we're getting that cold front coming in to cool us all thing, down. I'm excited for you to start applying some of that stuff. That will be awesome. I love people, man. <laughs> hey, I already do. Let, let me mention a couple of dates to you real quick. Again, share this on your platforms because we want to get the word out. October is uh, uh, is on us. I mean, where has the year gone? I mean, it seems like we just got off spring break in August. Yeah. <laughs> and, I'm hoping uh, when we set the clocks back, it'll hit the factory reset on 2020. And that's November 1st. Yeah. You know what else has happened on November 1st besides that? What's that? Is we're going to open up in the 11 o'clock service our children's oh, area pre yeah school and children so it's gonna be 11 o'clock only we're gonna keep that nine o'clock for the at-risk service and so we want to uh, open that back up at 11 that's gonna be a great thing we'll continue to do our family style worship through the month of November because we'll be limited capacity uh, on that November 1st so mark your calendar parents it's gonna happen and on that that means October the 18th Ashley and Kristen are gonna be doing training for our children's uh, workers uh, that are going to be volunteering back there. We've got a whole new crop of folks. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you've not signed up crop, and you want to be... A crop of folks? A crop. Crop of crop folks? Crop of folks. You know, like a crop, Jake. They're, we're, we're seeing new things. Oh, new oh so a bunch of new volunteers. Growing. Yeah. Okay. And, and so on October 18th, they're going to be doing some training, talking about how we're doing that, how we're going to register, how kids are going to be in rooms, that kind of stuff. So mark your calendar for that. If you want to be a part of that, get in on that. And then on October the 11th, Jake, we're going to bring back communion uh, oh. during the service. And so we've ordered all of our the communion Lord's stuff. Supper. Yeah, we've ordered about 1,500 cups of uh, communion, uh, those little cups that have everything all yeah. in one. And so we're going to have that. We'll be working that back into the service. And then on October the 4th is a Sunday as well. We're kind of reverse engineering the month of October. I was about to say, you started with I know, a, like one of those movies that starts you started at the with the end, time and then you go to the beginning. Yeah. But October the 4th, we're going to do baby dedication. We've not had a baby dedication in a while. We're supposed to do one in the spring, but with COVID and all that good stuff, uh, we weren't able to do that. So we're going to be doing a baby dedication during the 11 o'clock service. If you have um, a grandbaby or a baby uh, that has been born in the last couple of years, year, and you've not had that baby dedicated yet, and you want to, uh, get in touch with Kristen, and she will get all that arranged for you. Uh, in October. October is going to be a busy You month. forgot about October 23rd and 24th. And what is that, Jake? Big Ten football is going to start playing again. Did they vote to do that? They voted to do that. Of course, we here in the South, we'd already been playing football. Well, but hey, them, them boys up north. Hey, I had a buddy of mine tell me one time, follow the money. Yeah. That's why they opened that thing back yeah. up. Hey, speaking so. of following the money, can I make a plea? Sure. I need some first impressions volunteers. Yes, we do. Now, I know that has nothing to do with money, but I just thought it'd be a good segue. Uh, so as we begin to open things back up, children's ministry, uh, as we start to uh, dabble back into communion, see, I use a little phrase there, dabble, dabble. back into, dabble. I'm going to need more first impressions volunteers. And so be looking for me Sunday if you've got an interest in serving first impressions. It's a great way to plug in. It's a great way to serve. It's a good entry point uh, into service at Summit Heights Fellowship. Um, send me an email, jake at summitheightsfellowship.com or grab me Sunday and let's talk about putting you on a team. You can serve once a month. Uh, and we, man, we'd love to have you. We're going to need you as we start to open back up. Yeah, you know, there's been a ton of new people coming lately, and that's that's been so exciting. That 11 o'clock service is packed, yep. and um, so it's cool. Hey, did you see the stage this week? Oh, yeah, we got a new screen. Hey, wait till you see it. You cannot miss Sunday. Got a new screen. So dad gum cool. Yeah, it's going to be you. awesome. Um, we're we're going to be showing the Cowboys on the middle screen, have the worship on both ends. I, it's going to be awesome. Huh. 
Well, hey, Summit, we love you. We're going to continue block party this week and uh, going to be talking about encouragement and everybody. <laughs> My number needs, one spiritual gift. Um, so anyway, we're going to be talking about encouragement this week and uh, uh, don't miss it. It's going to be good. We had a ton of comments last week. Jay. Yeah, Just encouraging people, comments, I bet. Um, really working through that whole love and choosing wisely mm -hmm. and uh, even kids coming to me and talking to me about that so don't don't miss that it's going to be good and i'm excited uh that we're going to get to meet this sunday nine o'clock at risk service 11 o'clock family worship you got anything else brother i'm good to go man i'm I, just ready for that cold front uh, yeah it's coming mm -hmm. love you summit we'll see you sunday